Hey guys so yes another driving video another rainy day we're at the mary brown's corner we're on the compound of the rory king texico gas station one side is on manning's hill road that's to my right the other side is on constant spring road that's to my left so today we're just doing a a drive on constant spring road we know this is one of the thoroughfare that you know recently got upgraded and um, realigned and everything so we're just driving from here up to Manor Park um, and as usual I was showing you guys around the place as well so stay tuned and definitely you know the drill guys if this is your first video if it's the first time you're watching a video on the channel definitely subscribe turn on your post notification bell as well so that once I do an upload you'll be notified um, remember to like leave a comment and share all that will help the YouTube Algorithm to recommend the video to even more persons. So support the channel guys Thank you for supporting to all the person that keep watching keep commenting and again the aim of the channel is just to you know highlight some of the good things are the good things that are happening in Jamaica whether it may be construction um, a new apartment a new commercial development a new park whatever it is the aim of this channel is to highlight all the great things that are happening in jamaica so that both persons locally and you guys overseas as well um can definitely see so leave a comment let me know what the weather is like where you at it's a rainy day for me here in kingston jamaica so let me know what the weather is like where you at so we're going up constant spring road stay tuned hope you enjoy the drive and leave your comment all right so coming up on our right is kosher bank i know one of the main news last week um, is where Scotia is closing quite a few number of branches and converting some of them to um, you know basically self-serve um, branches which does little to no cash transaction uh, we know COVID has changed so much you know it has it has helped a lot of business to innovate and to realize that they can do a lot more um, over the internet uh, they can use, do a lot more using their technology. They can do a lot more um, without certain amount of staff as well. So while COVID has done is bad for certain businesses, it has showed them you know ways to cut costs that they will definitely not change moving forward and will keep even after COVID. So Scotia is closing a few branches, and a lot of persons will be losing their job, especially persons who probably have been working there for years. I know most persons that work at a bank, it's their career, you know, and they move up the ladder. Let me know what you guys think about that. On the right again is the new Super Value Town Center. I did a very in-depth video on that plaza, so you guys can always check it out. Um, I'll put it in the description as well for you guys, so you guys can check that out. Um, what I'll probably do when the rainy season is over... Probably I'll do a walking tour of the plaza. I see they're putting up Christmas decoration already. So when we have some better weather, I'll do a, another walking video of the plaza. Uh, to my left is the popular Constant Spring um, Revenue Center. Um, that's on the left. Constant Spring Tax Office. And then we have, you know, this popular school on the right. 
you know, Immaculate Conception High. How many you, did any of you guys attend this school that's watching? Let me know in the comments if this is your school. Alright, so we're heading up to Mana Park. Um, stay tuned and enjoy the drive. Right, and even though we know constant spring is 100% complete as we see ever so often um, more work is happening on the constant spring road seem as if they're changing some drainage pipe uh, what I don't like though guys sometimes it's after the road is completely finished they still go ahead and dig up again to either run pipes for water commission or to do drainage work and I don't like the planning behind that, you know, because this road was perfectly finished. I know we see they're digging up that side beside Immaculate Conception High um, to lay drainage and stuff like that. Let me know what your thoughts about that, because we see that so often on these roads. So heading up to Manor Park. Stay tuned. Do you want the So we, we're just passing the Mana Center shopping plaza. Alright, so right here on the left was where the Constant Spring Market was. Um, it's now completely cleared off. And they're also putting up a wall or a perimeter fence. I'm not sure what the future plan for this area is because they had to move the market to expand the road but I'm not sure what they're gonna plan or what they're gonna put over there so if you guys know the plans for that area let me know in the comment section all right guys so we're basically in Mana Park that very beautiful multi-story building in front of us um, it's residence to the US Embassy um, I think they use it for their delegates and their guests as living residents. Um, I was told it was a plaza before. So now they converted it from a plaza to their property. The United States of America property. Alright, so right here has been... You know, renovated as well you know some beautification work was done here um, this is a bus stop um, a few vendors as well all right guys so that was a quick drive you know from Mary Brown's corner to to Manor Park so again definitely leave your comments remember to like remember to subscribe Remember to share as well and thanks for clicking on this video and I'll definitely see you on another driving video. Stay tuned.